What is going on everybody? Everybody, Welcome back to Civilization 5 as China in the Earth 2014 mod. This video we're going to move all our units over towards Thailand and get ready for the war against Thailand and then following on from that the invasion of India that will come from it. Um, what should I build here? Quickly build that and then that will be it. I will be happy. I'll be done with this campaign. So only probably two, three, four maybe videos left. So pretty cool. What am I doing with this guy? Don't fly. I don't know. Go over, where, why is there no road between here? Why do you have to go all the way around? That's really annoying. Like imagine you were in Shanghai and you wanted to go on holiday to Kunming. Or the other way around. You'd have to go all the way through like here. That must be a nightmare. We'll have to fix that. Anyway. Boom. A zoo. Wow, this city is really bad for production. Okay, I'm going to move all my planes to somewhere a little bit better. Singapore so that we can take out Thailand very nicely I don't know probably gonna try and have two turns of bombing half our planes doing one city half doing the other so half our planes bombing Bangkok and then we can use the destroyer there and then the other the military going in for Rangoon I think that's how you say that can't put any more in Singapore no Okay, so they could stay here and the rest can move to Kunming. There we go. There we go. Over here. Good. Don't forget, we do have our nuclear missile submarine. What's over here? Nuclear missile. What's here? Okay, we need to move these jet bombers down here to help out. Boom. There, there we go. That is all good. Next turn. Let's see if Pakistan survive this, this gap. Or gap next turn December 2017 we are in well into the future now here we go oh wait, it's Russia's go uh, Russia Russia trying they're kind of trying to take Fukuoka that's my best attempt at that I'm not going to give you another attempt in case that was awfully wrong how's Europe looking Warsaw is still in the red but no one's taken it how is South America doing? I'm surprised Mexico and America haven't attacked anyone. Cuba, Panama, that's what I'd be doing. Okay, there we go. So Pakistan wiped out by India. So by trying to make, uh, trying to weaken India, we may have made them a lot stronger. But we should have success against India as long as we strike first with our nukes. You know, one probably, I think, how many, we've got five. One, two, three, yeah, five. So... Probably be one in Calcutta. Although we want to use them helpfully as well. We don't want to waste them. So I'll probably do one in Mumbai. And have the Navy here to help out. And the same with Calcutta. So that like in one turn we can take over. That would probably be the plan. Uh, Bangkok. Should we just get it going? Should we just... We've got a mechanised infantry. I'm going to send some more units over actually. Boom. Okay there we go. And stay here give it a couple of turns just to get everything ready let a bit of the happiness come back that we've lost send over our units with a great general do we have any rocket artillery anywhere that'd be pretty helpful uh no none okay i'm gonna send all the boats over anyway as i said for helping out with whatever they need doing destroying the indian navy whatever and you come over here okay and another missile cruise we could probably put our nukes on these to be fair uh are we ready no one more turn as i said i'll say oh cargo ship where where are we going here seal for 40 that sounds like a good idea mechanized factory boom adopt policy okay here we go chinese freedom six units of maintenance free none of these are going to help are any of these going to help in the war? No. More great people. None of these. Re more culture. There we go. We'll go for that. We've got quite a few great works. So more culture is going to be nice. There we go. Next turn. So that's the plan. Impal will probably use the air force on. So I said they will nuke Calcutta and Mumbai. Probably leave Delhi out. Unless they have their, unless it, their nuclear missile is moved there, and then, 
yeah, we'll use the military to try and grab hold of these two in the east, Mumbai here as well. And then just sort of fight from east to west, I guess. Could try come through the north from here, but it's not going to go successfully. So most of our units are going to come through Thailand, across this bay. Is this the Bay of Bengal or is this the bay? I don't know. Or is like this little bit the bay? I don't know, so I'm not going to say which one. Is it this one? This little thing? Or like all of this? Pretty sure it's like all of this. I don't know, it may be all of this. Argentina v France. It's not a good move Argentina, now everyone's going to hate you. And, oh, South Korea has nukes. The new North Korea is South Korea. Great. Need to keep an eye out on that. Oh, yep, everyone's declaring city-states, Thailand, Mongolia. Why are my friends? Oh, no, they're not my friends anymore. That's why. That's good news. Okay, all these units are out here. That's good. Where's the nuclear submarine with the nukes on? Where did I put that? I don't think I moved it. There is. Okay, you can head over as well. Okay, here we go. This is a big, big moment, kind of. No one's protecting them. That's good. And they just declared a war, so no one likes someone that declares a war. Sadly, I have no idea who they became friends with just before. Okay, we've got one happiness, so we need to be careful. Jet fighter. Attack there, I think. Okay, this war's going to take a little bit longer unless we do it one city at a time. Which wasn't really the plan. It's taken longer to get Bangkok down than I expected. But we've got the army here helping out this time should speed things up a little bit yeah I'm not going to attack the city I'm going to try to get rid of all these units because I think they maybe start to cause a problem if we're not careful Boom. okay let's try get rid of all these units let's get so that they do not pillage any of our tiles as well that is a big important thing to do boom ah oh, we just failed uh that, no, they're all destroyers. No battleships. Uh, can't reach. Wait, if I go here, should be safe. Boom, that's one destroyed. Other missile cruiser. There we go. Any more planes? None at all. Okay. Alright, there's five more here. Who am I kidding? We can get Bangkok. We could take Bangkok this turn. That's pretty impressive. Create puppet. Boom. We are very unhappy again. Yep, seven unhappiness. There we go. That That's enough for this time. Well, we can start bombing their capital. Or not, I don't know. I don't know what is their capital. I mean, there's more countries than Thailand and Vietnam, so it's not exactly realistic. Pretty sure Rangoon is in Burma. Not. Or Myanmar. I don't know what they call it anymore. But Bangkok is actually Thailand's capital. But there we go. We have now connected our empire to this little bit, which so, so it's all looking much nicer, and we're doing really well. That's good. I mean, does being unhappy really matter? Production sucks, but we've got a huge military already. Gold city will only cities will only grow at half speed. That doesn't matter. We want it to stop growing anyway. We've got the most people in the world, I think. If we can take Rangoon next turn, we'll have done everything pretty much that I wanted to do within 50 turns. That's pretty cool. And then it will be time for the big one. India. Who could we get to help us? I think we should probably try to get Iran to help us out. I'm pretty sure if I said, shall we declare war on someone, anyone would say yes. Like, Iran. I don't know. Looks like Arabia are going to get destroyed anyway. Oh, Turkey now has nukes. It's going to be very unstable region now. Israel no longer so strong without their, without being the only ones to have a nuke or access to them. How is the USA doing? Nothing's happened over here. The Americas have just been very boring all campaign. That's that's all they've done. Okay, we just got a lot of unit promotion. Wait, you want me to shoot a cargo ship of America? No. <laughs> okay. Okay. No. Boat. Boats. Come around here. 
You could actually. Ooh. Okay. I don't know why. Okay. Yes, we can use these safely without them getting destroyed. I don't want the unhappiness to drop too much, so I'm just gonna take a couple of turns off now. Oh, who can? Get... Okay, I missed the upgrade. Hang on. What am I doing? H. I was pressing the wrong button. There we go. Okay, we'll come back to all the upgrades in a second. Skip them all for now. And promote. Uh, naval units, cities. Cities will help because that's mainly what we're going to be using you for. Uh, interception. Especially against India who will have an air force that will come in handy. Again, just getting the, all these siege ones up so that we can really do some damage to cities. Chill far enough away to not get destroyed. Next turn. Pearls. Yes, but Obama. I'm sorry, mate. you got to pay a little bit more. No? Wait, how is Obama still in charge, guys? Look, it's 2018. Should be Trump or Clinton. I, I don't know who it would be. I don't think it'll be Trump. Like... I just don't think he'll win. In the end, when it comes down to it, I don't think he'll win. But anyway, I have no idea who is doing this and who is about to take over Saudi Arabia. Whether it be Israel, Iran, India, America, <laughs> anyone. Russia very much not having success here, at least. That's good news. We are going to get seriously unhappy taking out India. I did not think about that. And if our unhappiness gets below 20... Then obviously we are going to suddenly lose quite a bit. Oh, India are still growing, which is scary. We need to be quick to declare this war. Finally, something in America. Canada and America v. Argentina. Not too much will happen, I don't think, but at least something ha kind of happened. There's kind of a war to watch out for. Should probably buy some more happiness buildings again. I don't know how we're going to do happiness <laughs> once we invade India. That could be a problem. I'm probably just going to give up on happiness at that point. But then I don't want cities to revolt. That is a big worry. Okay. Bomb. Just do a couple of bombing runs on, some of, on the city. Keep it in the red. Don't let it fully heal. Stoneworks. Who needs orders? Who lost their cap? Oh yeah, Saudi Arabia did. I was going to say. Move forward. Boom. Boom. Just keep it low. Ish. Try get rid of the mechanised infantry as well here. I mean, I guess there won't be much population in India for the unhappiness if we drop some nukes. Which I guess is a good thing. Kind of. It's kind of sad because everyone's dead, but... Whatever. Okay, who needs orders? Uh, we can get it all the way down, but I don't want to take it just... Well, we can take it. As long as, it, as long as our happiness does not go below 20, we should be okay. Puppet. Boom, there we go. So it's now at 9. So go to a bad city again. And purchase something for happiness. Uh, zoo. Plus 2. Stadium. There we go. So that, that keeps it at negative 5, which isn't too bad. And once all these cities as well, like this one here is out of resistance in 4 turns or whatever, everything should get a little bit better. So we should probably take a little break now from till the end of this video. And when we come back, it will probably be processed a little bit further into the future, unless something huge happens. And I'm just going to let the happiness recover move all the units into place it's gonna take a long time to get all these units and stuff down here ready to start pushing in get all the units I actually want let the happiness all of these cities probably including this one so Rangoon seven so at least seven turns plus getting courthouses and everything as well until we will begin the invasion of India so we're about to get cloning as well in four turns so yeah that's probably what's gonna happen we're going to take a little bit of a warry rest because the last two videos alone we've grabbed one, two, three, four, five cities. That is, and I mean, if you go to the one before that and add Vietnam, that's six. So we've been pretty aggressive in the last two videos. 
still got to keep an eye out for Russia, but we're going to try to go out with a bang. We're going to try to go out with a very big bang and become the powerhouse of Asia. Literally. So. I mean, we'd have to take out all of India, by the way. Like, I don't want to get the Arabian city there. I only want to take India, India. So I'm not even probably going to go after the former Pakistan cities. Just India, like the big triangle. Best way to describe that shape. Uh, happiness. No happiness. Nothing. Oh, bank. Happiness. Our people want money. Capitalist China. Spaceship factory? No. We're not building a spaceship. Okay. Once the city's got everything, we're just going to start building more jet bombers. Just more and more. We don't really... could probably go for one more nuke. Possibly. Just, just one. No more. No less. Just one. Could do. Okay then, here we go. Next turn. You know what guys, I don't want this to get too tedious. I was going to say I'll end it here, but I won't. Just yet. Something could happen. I'll keep going to the end of this video, but it's just going to be me. Picking some production. Lots of stuff's close to finishing, actually. Oh, we are about to get another nuclear missile. Five turns. Pearls. Okay, well, I'll have to say through four gold. If an embassy's worth one. Yep, there we go. Boom. More money. Yeah. Okay, who's next? No. I, why would I want coal? I, I, I just remembered how little India wanted for us to declare war on Pakistan. It was like two gold per turn. Some coal horses and iron, which we don't even use anymore. They were pretty aggressive there. So I'd like to see what Israel does next if they go after it. Egypt is probably not the best idea. Egypt looked like probably the strongest city state in this entire game. Dunno, there may be some others who are pretty strong. But with three pretty good cities, I mean three bigger than Israel's cities. Although a nuclear missile in the middle here could probably hit all three. I think Israel should go after Iraq, and then probably Egypt, or Turkey maybe. Maybe even Iran, if they're feeling brave, maybe they can get a friend involved. Wait, what happened to the holy city for Judaism is following Islam, okay. Whatever game, <laughs> whatever. Okay, as stay here, how many planes do we have? Okay, there we go, that should be all of them more planes maybe some guided missiles to help out oh wrong button jet bomber so let's have a quick look at the demographics fully obviously we don't get the info addicts on this mod i don't think they're compatible or i didn't try but i don't think they are but okay population number one 62 million just a little bit less than what there actually is in china right now of 1 billion plus like is it 1.5 billion ish probably crop yield number one production we are second to america gmp we are number one best economy land we're third i think russia and canada are ahead although it depends how this mod does it maybe america but i'm pretty sure realistically it's canada soldiers were second only to america approval 19th that is not good there's only that <laughs> pretty much last yep we are last even here literacy we are seventh the USA has nearly completed the tech tree. So pretty good for them. Well done, America. You can have our round of applause. But that, guys, is going to be it for this video. As always, if you have enjoyed, please be sure to leave a like, leave a comment, maybe even subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.